Hey guys, it's Kevin. There's a viewer asked me that his printer has a problem, which is the capping station. After it sucks out the remaining ink, it returns ink back to the printer and stands the printer. Let's take a look. Now we can see the capping station is pretty full, and uh, we can hear the more starts spinning. And now if we look at the waste tank, we can see air bubbles. Now the printer squirts ink and the white color is not clogged. That's, that, that's better. So uh, let's see the ink. Now the ink gets sucked into uh, the waste tube. Ink disappeared from the capping station. Majerigo, yes, I agree. Majerigo means the ink seems coming back <laughs> to the surface of the camping station. And now we see the camping station starts uh, regurgitating the ink. And sometimes it's so violent, actually the ink uh, spit out like fountain and uh, explodes everywhere. And now we start seeing the ink stands the platform that the ink just lay everywhere is create, start creating a mess. The reason for this is your capping station is partially clogged. I made a video about this and I'm going to put a link above and show you how to unclog it. And there's different levels. And sometimes you have to take the whole capping station apart. And that's another video that I also put a, the link above and in the description. So when you have a clock in a tube, and this clock can move with liquid, when the capping station is working, so the tubes actually open, and the clock just flowing towards where your connector is. So that's why you can see the air bubbles when you do the cleaning. And then the clock, when it stops, and the motor is still spinning, so it sucks all the liquid from the capping station and put in the tube and there's a pressure, okay? And then when the motor stops spinning and this pressure is going to flow backwards and then that's why you say regurgitating the ink. As I said, 99% of our printed clock starts with a capping station. So you have to have this fixed right now. Otherwise, next thing is your printhead will be gone. And I can see you printhead still squirting a good amount of white ink. So uh, you need to uh, work on the capping station right now. And also I see you do the white capping, but you, I don't think you did it correctly. And uh, I have another video show you how to do daily maintenance. So this will never happen again. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video. Visit us at uh, bchtechnology.com or locally at Greensboro, North Carolina. Cheers.